Hi, this is the Bodum Milk Frother, and this is really good. So this is better than the one I used to have. Uh, it makes the milk really, really frothy. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to use it. So basically this piece here comes out, and you just have to make sure it's put in correctly. See how I did that wrong? So if you put it in wrong, it's gonna make a really loud, horrible noise. So you wanna make sure that you put it in correctly, okay? So it's gotta just, the little hole there lines up with the hole, and yeah, there it goes. So just like that. All right, so by the way, you do have to take this out to clean it. What I do to clean it is take this out and I get a sponge and I clean it with water and stuff. So I always clean it right after I use it so that the milk doesn't stick, see? So it, you have to be a little bit careful. There it is, so it has to be incorrectly. Next thing you do is put it here on this plate. This connects to a wall. Okay, I'm gonna get some milk. And almost out of milk. So I'm gonna pour some milk in. It's got a min and a max line. Um, you definitely want to uh, be aware of that. It's kind of hard to see with the camera, so you don't need that much milk. I'm just gonna go ahead and put in that much there. Maybe just fill up the rest, that's it. Yep, yeah. finish off the milk here. And then what you do is you put the lid on. Let me get the lid. Got it over here in the dishwasher. Just rinse it off. So here's the lid. That's the wrong lid. <laughs> so let me find the lid. Here it is. That's the lid to my old one, which broke, so. I'm gonna go ahead and throw this away. Here's the new lid. And then just press the button and it works. Let's see how it comes out. So yeah, I had another one of these I bought on Amazon. It was a different brand and um, it lasted about uh, over a year. And this one's better because, well one, you'll see how frothy the milk is, and two, it's got a button. The other one I had had like a, like a touch screen type thing where you like press the button and you had to press it twice and you couldn't tell if it was on. It was just really kind of annoying. Uh, but it worked, it worked for a very long time. So I got this one uh, because of the brand, uh, Bodum. I reviewed a coffee bean grinder by Bodum uh, a while back, and I thought it was really good. So when I was looking for a milk frother, I saw Bodum and I decided to go with this. There were some other ones on Amazon um, that were uh, higher rated, and they were actually slightly more expensive. Uh, this one uh, was a good brand, and I felt that it was a good value, so it's almost done. It's pretty quick. Just gonna put some here in my coffee. I've got a little bit of coffee left. Just to show you. Still working. It's kinda weird. I think it takes like a minute or so. Still frothing. Froth, froth, froth. Okay, so now let's undo this. I'm just going to push this back so you can see it pour in. So you just take this off. Look at that. It's really, really frothy. Look at all that. Wow. I mean, that's so much. Look, look how much froth it created. I can't even fill the cup and there wasn't even that much milk in there. So yeah, beautiful, beautiful froth. Very happy with this item. Good luck.